Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday, June 3rd. Uh, 8.48 a.m. I've been up since about 5.30 this morning because I couldn't sleep. I actually woke up about an hour before that and tried going back to sleep. 5.30 is when I actually got out of bed. Anyway, <laughs> um, we are going to be doing some more cleaning and purging around the house today. At least is what we can do with L Lily around, which is going to be interesting. And trying to run some errands. We're going to try to do it early-ish this morning because it was pretty hot yesterday. And I think today is supposed to be a repeat of that weather-wise. So anyway, we're going to get our day started and I'll be back. You know, he always smiles and cringes as soon as he sees me he hold up the phone. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> so we're out running a few errands this morning and the first step is, stop is to uh, get my car washed because the outside of my car is disgusting. Yeah, the inside's clean, the outside's really bad. So we're going to get the car washed. I'll be back. It is Monday morning, June crap. 4th, I think. Anyway, um, I'm pretty sure it's the 4th. It's 11.42 a.m., so it's still morning technically. I've been up since about 6.30 or so. Uh, and um, I was expecting somebody to come by um, for some estimates and stuff anyway. They didn't show up, but that's okay. Other stuff happened, so it's all good. Uh, I did get um, all of September filmed for all of my commitments. So I have the SD card on my desk so I can spend the rest of the afternoon after lunch editing. And then hopefully tomorrow um, or Wednesday I can get October filmed. So my goal is to get the year filmed. I think I've mentioned that already. Uh, Lily went home last night, and she's a super cute puppy and loving and energetic, but um, she went home. Thank goodness. <laughs> love her. I love you, Lily, but y yeah, I'm not used to um, having any kind of little ones, whether it has two feet or four feet, uh, underfoot all the time uh, anymore. So yeah, anyway, she was real cute, but oh my god, hungry all the time. I forgot how hungry puppies are, like all the time. Anyway, so I have stopped filming for the day, and I'm going to, um, I have an Etsy order that's got to go out, and I need to stop by the fabric store. It's just a matter of stopping, figuring out if I want to go to Morgan Hill, or if I want to go to, up more north to San Jose. Time-wise, they're the same amount of time for my house. Um, it's just a matter of which is going to be less annoying, traffic-wise. Probably Morgan Hill, so that means I'm probably going to Hobby Lobby. That's okay with me. I need just a couple things. I'm not gonna buy too much. I just need a couple things. So that's it for the moment. I will be back. I obviously decided to go to Joanne Fabrics. <laughs> See what they have, shall we? Okay, so I got a bunch of snaps and some other like little sewing hardware parts that I've been out of. I did say earlier on a video I was shooting for something else that I, I, I'm not really into dressmaking anymore, although I used to be a dressmaker, um, but I do like making bags and I was looking for some of these kind of like strap hooks and I found them 
um, and I found some really big, huge jumbo sew-on snaps, which are really cool. So I got, I probably won't need to buy any, like, for my lifetime. I'm probably set. I got a few sheets. I mean, I didn't get a ton, a ton, but I don't use them that often, so anyway. I probably purged them the last time I had any, and that's why I only found the one snap when I was making um, a project earlier that I was working on, which is why I went yeah, to do this. So anyway, it's in an upcoming video for next month. So anyway, we are going to go get the mail. There's a bunch of stuff that came in, including an order from um, Shannon Green's Etsy store and a new order of postcards and stuff from Vistaprint that I need to um, look at and will probably be going up for sale in the Etsy shop at some point and stuff like that. I also need to eat lunch because I'm starving. Alright, that's it for the moment. I'm just sitting at the red light in traffic in San Jose as usual. Yeah, nothing new. Okay, so one of the things I'm doing today besides everything else I've done today, including all the filming, is I'm boiling here some onion skins, and um, this is my ink making pot, a dedicated pot for this kind of experiment. So this is some red onion skins and leavings from dinner, cutting up an onion for dinner last night, and I'm gonna boil um, them, and I'm gonna, um, it, I brought the water to a boil with the skins in it, and then I just reduced it down. So I'm gonna leave it to simmer and reduce um, for a while, like 30 minutes to even an hour, uh, low and slow until it um, reduces down and gets thick and really absorbs all the po color possible from the onions. We'll see what color we come out with. All right, I'll be back. Okay, so we've boiled our onion water and it's all cooled off and reduced. So I'm going to pour it through this strainer into this measuring cup. This is all like stuff I use just for art projects and crafting. I don't use any of these for food, FYI. into one of these bottles. Got a little bit extra, which I thought I might, so I brought an extra bottle. Okay, I'm gonna put two like drops of glycerin in that almost empty bottle and like five or six in the full bottle to act as a preservative. And okay. Now the test. What color what color is it gonna be? I've got a scrap piece of white card and a uh, white watercolor paper and a brush. Let's test it, shall we? Let's actually put some in the cap. No idea what to expect. When we did the avocado skin, we got um, reddish purple with both the skin and the and the seed. And when we, uh, I have coffee ink and stuff like that, which is a brown. Oh, this is a pretty color. It's a brownish red color. It sort of looks like coffee. Or a weak tea. Oh, interesting. Let me dry it and I'll be right back. Okay, so interesting. 
So this is the Avocado Skin Ink color that we got. This is the Avocado Seed color that we got. So two varying shades of red. The skin color looks, actually in my opinion, looks like kind of like blood. <laughs> but both in interesting shades of reddish pink. And then the onion color came out when it dried. Look at this green. This greenish brown. So really interesting. These would be interesting to paint with, which is, of course, the next step. So I'm going to cut, like I did here, I'm going to cut this into a couple pieces and tape one to, to each one of the bottles so I know what the color is. And yeah, I can't see what else I find next to make ink out of, but I'll let you know. All right, that's it for the moment. I'll be back. Hey guys, it is Tuesday, June 5th, I think. It is Tuesday. Um, I forgot to vlog this morning. No excuse. I just got up and started doing other stuff and forgot. And then was chatting with friends and still forgot. Um, and I'm in the car getting ready to get the mail. Realized that I forgot to mail a package I should have mailed yesterday. Oops, it's going out today. Um, and... Um, yeah, I was gonna maybe head over to Daiso this morning. I have a friend that needs me to get some stuff, but I didn't make it over there today. So I think I'm thinking I'll go like maybe tomorrow or Thursday. And that's really it. There's just, I'm taking a day off. Did a lot of filming and a lot of work yesterday. Today, the only important thing I'm doing is laundry. So, you know, there's that. Um, I am doing the stencilified journal at least for as many weeks as I can manage and I did do week two today which doesn't air until next week or go public until next week. It's not a video, it's just images. So if you want to see what I'm doing in that regard, you need to follow me on Facebook or Instagram or something like that, Google+. Plus. Um, if you go to the video description here on YouTube and click on my link tree, um, you're going to come up with a list of links to all the different places I am on the internet. My website, Facebook groups, Instagram, everything. So click on that and go follow me somewhere. Um, I did week one aired yesterday. So anyway, that's it for the moment. I'll be back. Palmasan Mountain Winery uh, for a concert. We're here to see Brian Setzer. So I tried to get footage on the way up, but I think it's a little shaky. Whatever I can salvage, I'll insert it here because the drive up is pretty. But yep, let's go find our seats. <music> after a really great concert by Brian Setzer and his band, his, or what does he call it? Brian Setzer Orchestra? The, the Slavin Orchestra is the band. Yeah, anyway, but, they uh, did a great job. Yeah. I will put a link to his fan page or whatever I can find in the description below. If you don't know who he is, check him out. That's it. We're gonna go home now and have a cup of tea because I'm also freezing. Oh my God, is it cold? <laughs> Anyway, I'll be back. Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday. Um, January 6th? I think so. Anyway, I'm really tired this morning. We were up at the concert late last night. It was really fun, but I'm really tired. Um, and I couldn't sleep last night. <laughs> Number one, I was freezing cold by the time we got home because it was really cold last night up at the mountain winery. So, 
Anyway, I'm going to head out this morning early because I don't want to fight afternoon traffic. If I have to fight traffic, I'd rather do it this morning. And I need to um, hit up a Dollar Tree and I need to do some um, Daiso shopping for a friend. So we're going to go do both of those things this morning and I'll take you with me. We'll be back. Okay, so Dollar Tree had one of the things I was looking for which I got, thank goodness, some little um, sort of aqua-colored um, ceramic bowls. Turn left onto Stevens Creek Boulevard. There we go, there's Jeeves. Um, they didn't have the other thing, but that's okay. I think I'm gonna just have my husband make me some of the other thing. There are these wire geometric frames um, or little sculptures. I'll include a picture here. Uh, I am looking for them, um, but- In 1.1 miles, turn left. They could be made out of wire coat hangers or something else. But anyway, now I'm headed over to Daiso, so we'll see if they have what I'm looking for there. of filming this clip right now how much of the Daiso footage is clear and not shaky. Boy can you tell I'm tired. Ugh. Anyway, um, but that's a look around a Daiso store and uh, I did find almost everything my friend wanted and of course a few things for myself because you know. And I am gonna go to the grocery store now and then go home. What time is it? It's 10.58. Depending on how what time it is when I get out of the grocery store I might go try to get the mail but because then I don't have to go out again. I like that idea. We'll see what happens. Hey guys, it is Thursday, June 7th. I'm pretty sure. Um, it is 12.50 in the afternoon. I have almost forgotten to film for the vlog because I've been up since early this morning um, doing my daily writing and posting commitments on different Facebook groups and social media. Um, and then I went right into filming for October, um, which I got all my major commitments done. Um, so now I can, after lunch, edit them and get them loaded to YouTube. And then start working on November. And then after that, December. So I'm hoping to get actually all of the big YouTube commitments filmed and loaded uh, for all of 2018 by, my goal is by next Friday. I don't know if we'll meet it, but we'll find out. I have 
contractors coming over for estimates and stuff on Monday. So I don't know how much filming I'm going to get done. I'm going to try to get up early and get one or two things filmed before they come and then hopefully get some stuff filmed after they leave and that sort of thing. So we'll see what happens. We have some more um, repairs and stuff around the house that need to be done. So I'm going to be filming in between them when they're available to do them. So, um, And then I need to also film a bunch of videos for design team challenges and um, for my design team for my products. So I need to do that too. I've got a list. Don't worry, I've got a list. Right now we're going to take a break and go check on the mail and then eat lunch. I do have kind of a headache because I think I need to eat again. I also am dead tired and probably need some more caffeine because I'm not haven't been sleeping well. There's a lot of stuff going on. Not bad stuff, just stuff. Um, and you know, I'm of a certain age that, you know, insomnia is pretty common. In. <laughs> Those of you women out there in your mid 50s completely understand what I'm talking about. Anyway, um, I can't wait for you guys to see some of the pages I've been creating for some of these commitments because I, if I do say so myself, have turned out some really cool work. And um, one of the pages I did the, today was for Explorations of Me for October. And I love the way it came out. Love, love, love. So, anyway. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to go get the mail and I'll be back. I've so lost track of vlogging this week. I have no idea when I vlogged and when I haven't. <laughs> it's Friday, that I know for sure. June, I think it's the 8th, because I think tomorrow's the 9th. Anyway, it is um, just before one o'clock and I'm over at the shopping center where I pick up my mail. I've spent the morning doing some more filming and catching up on, um, not catching up on, filming ahead on stuff for my design team. And it's currently all edited and loading up to YouTube and getting scheduled out. Um, so currently I'm scheduled out all my commitments through October. Uh, my goal of course is before the end of June to be scheduled out for the rest of the year. Um, there's lots of business stuff going on that right now and I and stuff going on around the house and you know um, improvement stuff remodeling fix it stuff kind of thing that category so I need to really um, get filmed out through the rest of the year soon because then I don't then it's just one less thing I have to worry about to be honest so that's my goal right now um, I've been doing some more purging too of things and if you're watching this and you're local I have some um, Diva Curl Shampoo I'm no longer using. Sorry I'm getting a notification. Um, and, and styling products. So if you would like them they're free. I'm not using them. I have kind of a lot of it. Um, let me know email me. My email's in the description below. <laughs> um, and there's a pile of hardware-y type things at the curb I was giving away for free. Everybody took everything else except the little pipe fittings and things. Nobody seems to want them. So I'm going to bring them back in the garage and we'll either dump them or see if one of the workmen who's coming to the house to do repairs wants them. I don't know. That's it right now. That's a lot. I'm going to go check my mailbox. I'm waiting for more stencil inventory for the Etsy shop from um, the United Kingdom from my friend Mike Deacon. So hopefully that's in today. It is kind of a big order this time though. So it seems to be taking a little longer. I'm assuming it's because it's kind of a big order. So hopefully it does come in with no problem. And I was contacted this morning by a company about doing an affiliate um, thing with some of their products and a video or two or more so I am in negotiation with them so that may be coming I will make sure they are clearly marked so you all know that it's an affiliate video that being said I'm not going to tell you something about the product that's untrue just because it's an affiliate video so I don't do that 
All right, that's it for the moment. I can't think of anything else. I'm gonna go get my mail. It's like 80 plus degrees outside and it's really hot in my car. So anyway, I'll be back. See this? That's a solid, no packaging included stack of stencils. Over a hundred of them. All intended for the Etsy shop. Holy cow, I know what I'm doing the rest of the day. All right, I'll be back. Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday morning. It's just before noon, so technically it's still morning. And we've already had a pretty busy morning with Etsy shop orders and contractors coming over this morning. And now we're gonna go out and run a few errands before the kids come over for dinner. So it's gonna be a busy day. It's always a busy day. I know, right? So we'll be back. <laughs> Hi guys, it is Saturday evening and it is 8.30ish. The kids have gone home and we had a really great family dinner together. Played um, the game of life board game um, and just generally chit chatted about life and things and stuff that's going on. It was a nice visit um, and it was really funny that the, uh, as you saw in the prior clip, um, when we were choosing career cards, when we all landed on that section, uh, you know, the cards were face down. I just grabbed one at random. I chose the artist card. And while I didn't win the game, I wasn't, um, I was second. So, uh, I wish, I wish being a working artist was, uh, so easy in real life. <laughs> I really wish it was. It's not. Anyway, it is time to just go sit and chill. In the other room, I am looking at YouTube and I'm gonna close up the desktop computer because it's time. Um, I'm done with that and the little few things that are on here can be checked on, looked at, or read from the iPad in the other room. So that's it. I'm gonna reply to a few to YouTube comments and shut this off for the night. I hope you've all had a great week, that you still find the vlog interesting. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the comments below. If you wanna follow me on other social media or join, join one of my Facebook groups, um, click on the link tree link in the description below. And if you click on it, you're gonna find a list of every single place I am on the internet, um, including my Etsy shop, my website, all my Facebook groups, Instagram, everything. So pick one and join me. Uh, that's it for right now. Go out and have a great week, everybody. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it, and I'll see you later. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.